Hello everyone! Tonight we are watching the very first episode of Show Me Love the series that has come out today. I'm so ecstatic to watch it, so like... Wait... This angelic voice, oh my god, and I think I know this temple. ขอบคุณหนูมากเลยนะหนูว่าทําให้งานบวชวันเนี้ยสมบูรณ์มากเลยจ้ะขอบคุณนะคะเสร็จแล้วกลับเลยแล้วเปล่าคะค่ะเด
Jean Paul's character, interesting. Like the the dynamic is shifted, and I think um, the fact that we see her as like having this uh, hierarchy, and the fact that we see her having this uh, interesting uh, dynamic, means that you know. Uh, we can get more easily into her character. Like, it's not Charlotte, it's Shireen. So I think it, they did great to change the initial dynamic, you know. Like, she's not an aspiring beauty pageant uh, girl. Uh, she's not an aspiring beauty pageant candidate. So that's great. Mm, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Shampoo's character is so funny. She really is that unsuccessful, you know. I feel so bad for her. The three of them, they must be struggling so hard, like, because if you have no job, you get no money, you know. So. Oh my god, <laughs> yeah, see. I wish I could give them more. So she did try before. That's interesting. Like she said, she doesn't want to do it anymore. So basically she did it before. Mm. Come on. Yeah. The story is really plot driven. I'm really surprised about this. Like, it's going very fast. Maybe because it will be only 10 episodes, but still, it's going very fast. I like that as an introduction. It's really not boring. Good as for the writers and the director of photography, you know, for that. Really great. Oh, so cute. I love this car. Jelin! เจลีนป้าขอเข้าไปนะลูกได้ค่ะสวัสดีค่ะป้าชาสวัสดีค่ะป้าอ๋อเฮ้ยขอบคุณมากเลยค่ะเป็นไงบ้างจ๊ะห
เรื่องประกวดใช่ไหมคะแม่ mm-hmm. คือหนูก็คิดว่ามันก็ไม่ค่อยถนัดเท่าไหร่อะแต่ถ้าแม่ว่าดีหนูก็ไม่ขาดค่ะ yes. ส่วนหนูหนูประกวดเป็นเพื่อนเดียนาก็ได้ค่ะแม่ <coughs> แต่ว่าแม่คาดหวังมากนะ <coughs> หนูประกวดได้ค่ะแม่เพราะยังไงตารางงานหนูมันก็วางลงยาวๆอยู่แล้วอะเลิศมากจ้ะแต่มีหนึ่ง to to not say it's completely empty you know <laughs> I love it okay Diana I I forgot Diana I forgot her name like but it's Diana and then so n u d i is Lalin so yeah 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 let's go หนึ่งคนไม่ยอมไปค่ะแม่ใช่ค่ะพวกหนูนะโน้มน้าวใจกันสุดๆละแล้วก็ยังใจแข็งเกิดอะไรขึ้นชรีนเพื่อนๆหนูเขาก็ไปกันหมดแล้วนะแม่ก็รู้ที่หนูเคยเล่าอ่ะตอนเด็กๆหนูเดินสายประกวดไปทั่วแต่ก็ไม่เคยเห็นได้รางวัลอะไรเลยมันคงไม่ใช่ทางของหนูจริงๆอะค่ะโอ้ยชรีนจ๋าตอนนั้นกับตอนนี้มันก็ไม่เหมือนกันตอนนี้หนูมีแม่และหนูก็มีเพื่อนๆแม่เองอ่ะก็ไม่อยากขัดใจหนูหรอกแต่เล็กๆไม่ได้ให้หนูลงนะ Really, like it's so good that m a k i k i says things like this because it's so true that when you get burned for the first time when you're a kid, you know, you don't want to take the risk to get that pain anymore because it was so painful because it's it was either the first time she got rejected, it just you know it's just awful memory. But you see, like she's a grown up now, so of course she has to try again because obviously Shirin has the potential, and that's really her initial dream. So it's very important that m a k i k i really mentions that she's well supported now, that she has her and her friends. She has to be part of the competition. I love this. The dynamic. I'm the one who keeps doing it all. Oh. oh, we get flashbacks. So cool, and it's so pretty. Oh my god, the light and all. I'm obsessed. <laughs> really, like in a beauty pageant competition, you know. Yeah, she is deceived. Mm. Oh. I guess the problem with beauty pageant is that you know you use your body to compete. And uh, your physical appearance and like your the skill acquired, but all turn to like physical, and it's really hard to dissociate your abilities and yourself because what you see in the mirror is your own image, you know. So I guess that when you are not winning contests like this. You will feel like it's you, it's your being, that is being rejected by the competition and by the jury members. You know, so like, I get why she's sad, and I understand that she's afraid to put herself out there again, because that must have really created some very deep insecurities about herself. So, oh, Sharon, bye bye. I feel like I really want to give her a hug. Like it's going to be okay. Don't worry. <laughs> Just try to be happy and have some faith in yourself, because you are amazing. Oh. 
She is so pretty right now. <laughs> I'm obsessed with her jacket. <laughs> Yes! So so naga! Nong nong! Oh! Oh nice, we're in a bus here. Yeah. ถ้าเกิดท้องขึ้นมาจะทํายังไงเหรอว่าแม่ไม่รู้จักของเลยอ่ะเหรอฉันยอมให้แกไปทํางานกลางค่ําก็ทําไปแต่เรื่องจะไ
Oof. This tension. Oh, she dropped her phone. Is it okay? I hope it's not broken. I am loving everything about this scene. Oh my god, can you see like the very different background just put up all on the closing style? Like this is amazing. This is really well done. Oh my god, and the colors are even harmonious. And I love like the very distinct tone. Ingfa is in Fa, you know. <laughs> and uh Charlotte is in char. So like this is so interesting. Like she is really into this like tea color thingy. Whereas Ingfa is really into this blue colors thingy. Like this is so great. <laughs> I'm enjoying this so much. Like the little clues like this. <laughs> Shout out to the closing department for that one. <laughs> <laughs> she is flustered, I think. Like, she is. Oh my god. <laughs> we all know how to explain it. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry, Shirin. We know what happened right now. เดี๋ยวนะคนที่ต้องตกใจอะไรอ่ะคนที่ต้องตกใจอ่ะต้องเป็นฉันปะโอ้ไม่เกิดแล้วนี่ยังไงไม่ขับขี่อ่ะซื
Yeah. The rest is well deserved, you know. <laughs> That's interesting. They decided to make the dad pass away, like just like in Ingfa's real life. I feel like she will be able to really draw the emotions and the emotional load whenever the topic will reappear in the series. If it's mentioned in this introductory episode, I think it will play a part in the future, you know, like on Infa's mind or mindset or resolutions. Like, she will be able to draw this very dramatic tone because, like, life circumstances made her go through that pain. So she, it's a place that she knows where to pick up the emotion from. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, let's say that. Why? What did she do? Was she the one to ask her to leave in Bangkok? I'm not sure what, what they are talking about here. So, like, if you know, please let me know <laughs> because I'm totally in the dark right now. I love them so much, oh my god, oh my god, she's so cute, that's my girl, อ๋อโอ้ยเหรอโอ้ยทั้งนั้นขึ้นไปอาบน้ำอาบผ้าแล้วก็พักก่อนนะแล้วเดี๋ยวป้าจะขับเข้าไว้ก่อนนี่แล
อันนี้คิดสุดที่เจ๋งเกินไปแล้วอ๋อไม่ได้เจ๋งหรอกแม่แม่เขาต้องโกรธพี่อยู่ดีเนี่ยที่ฝากบอกแม่ด้วยนะตุนไม่ต้องห่วงพี่หรอกพี่อยู่ดีกินดีแล้วพี่ก็ออกตัวรอดได้สบายอืมผมบอกแม่ให้แล้วแม่ก็ดูไม่ได้โกรธอะไรมากนะI think she actually said like, "Look after her for me." I heard like the sentence like this. ก็จริงแต่ตูนรู้นะว่าการร้องเพลงอ่ะมันเป็นความฝันของพี่ใช่ไหมลองทําตามความฝันของตัวเองสักครั้งไม่ได้อะไรก็ไม่เป็นไรนี่ยังไงมันก็เป็นโอกาสที่คนจะได้ยินเสียงของพี่นะเรื่องเงินอ่ะเราไม่ต้องคิดมากกันรู้ปะตั้งใจเรียนก็พอแล้วถ้าพี่จะไปอยู่กรุงเทพสักพักหนึ่งอ่ะมันจะโอเคเปล่าถ้าพี่อยากไปตุนก็สนับสนุนพี่อยู่แล้วเพราะยังไงตุนก็อยู่กับแม่ที่นี่พี่ไม่ต้องเป็นห่วงเลยขอบใจนะอืมอิทส์ like so so endearing she has such a beautiful beautiful complicity with her brother like oh This is so touching. I love it, and I love that you see, Shireen and Mina really comes from different perspective. So far, you can see that Mina she is putting herself out there. She seems like a fighter, even though maybe she has tried things before. Like she is trying again because she has to succeed, you know. Whereas Shireen is more inward, you know. And like she has this energy that something happened in the past, she's afraid to put herself out there again. So I see already how the complementary personality will match so well, and that they will learn from each other and grow from each other. Like I can totally see the potential of this ship right now. <laughs> so great, loving it. ยังไงไหนเล่าใครทําคุณเชอรีนโมโหได้ก่อนคะเนี่ยก่อนกลับบ้านไปก็ยังดีๆอยู่นี่ก็ชันนะดิเกือบขับรถชนคนอ่ะโอ้ยจะหายอะไรแกไหมอ่ะ
บอกไปแล้วชดใช้ให้วันอื่นอะ่ะเราฉันก็แยกออกมาเลยแปลกๆนะแกเหมือนจะไม่ยอมแต่ก็ยอมอะ่ะงงเหมือนกันเนี่ยแม่กิกี้ส่งข้อความมาอีกแล้วโชลินแกไปประกวดเถอะเข้ามาสภาพนี้หลับตาคุยแล้วแน่ๆชัวค่ะอีกสักพักก็จะไม่ตอบเพราะว่าตุ๊บค่ะสามสองหนึ่งสุดคิวต์วางก็วางไหนๆจ้าโอ้สุดคิวต์โอ้ my god this is such a friend thing to do Mina, let's go. <laughs> let's go on with your day. Oh my God, Shirin is already all prepped up and all. <laughs> I'm loving these parallels. Like it's very equal. <laughs> This dork. Yes, you are really pretty. <laughs> Wait, it's too good news. Like first, she is received at her singing contest, and second, like her mom is actually. Back to talking to her, like, oh, what a good day to be alive! Like, so happy for her. Did she like so this? <laughs> I feel like in the in this series, <laughs> Shirin and slash Charlotte has to like is a shouter, you know. <laughs> Because from the preview, the official teaser, like she was already screaming so much, <laughs> and now like it's the first episode. It's not even one of the scenes that we saw in the preview, but like she's screaming. No. <laughs> 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 Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, like breathe. <laughs> มาเริ่มเลยอ่าสาวคะมาสายแต่ชิงหลับก่อนนะเมื่อคืนน่ะชิงตัวเก่งพอดีคนมันง่วงอ่ะอ่ะแล้วแกจะเปิดตอนทำ
me, let's have you. The way I love her friends so much. <laughs> This dynamic, oh my god. <laughs> Trapped by her own friend, but it's a good trap. They did it for her well-being, you know. <laughs> Sneaky, sneaky friends. ขอต้อนรับเข้าสู่การเดินทางครั้งใหม่ของพวกเราอย่างเป็นทางการจ้าโอ้ยแซ่บ the way she looked at Heidi like Sitting contest. What's written on it? Open mic. Yep. So good. Oh my god, you're okay. <laughs> The mom is sulking still, you know. <laughs> oh my god. Come on. Oh. So cute. <laughs> That's so apparent thing to do. ขอบคุณพี่ๆมากเลยที่ไม่ช่วยหนูเคลียร์กับลูกค้านะคะถ้าไม่ได้พี่ๆมาช่วยเคลียร์กับลูกค้าว่าหนูร้องเพลงไม่ได้ไม่หวังจะดูได้แล้วตอนดิวงานมาลูกค้าไม่ได้บอกหรอกว่าต้องร้องเพลงอ่ะแล้วนี่ยิ่งเรามาจากต่างประเทศด้วยนะอืมเขาดิวแค่ว่าให้หนูมาโชว์ตัวจะดิวงานอะไรก็ต้องดูดีๆจะมั่วหน้างานไม่ได้แล้วอย่างลูกค้าเขาคงน่าจะลืมด้วยแหละมั้งหนูผิดเองนะพี่ช่วงนี้อ่ะผู้จัดการหนูลาป่วยเลยไม่มีคนมาช่วยดูโอ้ยแจถ้าระวังก็ดีเนาะจะได้มาช่วยดูแลน้องอ่ะ I totally know what's on her mind oh my god nudie <laughs> the strategist <laughs> She totally wants to get her in the company. Oh my god, <laughs> this is so clear. I see into your game. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe this is so obvious. Like play it tuned down. Like. Oh my god. 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 ยินดีช่วยเต็มที่เนาะชลินเนาะ You're too obvious เจไม่มี AR หรือว่าผู้ช่วยอะไรแบบนี้หรอก
ไม่มีค่ะหนูมีแค่ผู้จัดการ The fact that they called her Faye you know like my heart my heart พี่พีมีแนะนำไหมคะหรือว่าถ้าพี่พีวางก็ดีมากเลยตารางแน่นมากไม่ค่อยมีเวลาเลยเดี๋ยวพี่แชทก่อนนะเป้โอ้ my god เราต้องเอาเฟมเป็นของเราให้ได้ I can't with you เก็บเล่นตัวเพื่อ exactly Oh my god, the plot to you guys. จริงจริงพวกพี่อ่ะยุ่งมากเลยนะเฟแต่ว่าเพื่อเฟอ่ะเดี๋ยวพี่เคลียร์คิวให้ Yeah sure. จริงจริง The time that you have. ถ้าเฟสนใจก็ไปคุยกันต่อที่บริษัทไหมดีเลยค่ะ But I mean, you know, if like she actually searches. She won't see many events, so like, why, <laughs> why are you risking it all by lying in front of her face? Like, <laughs> this is so like corny. Oh my god. Oi, s i n i n g that's a queen. Too bad, right? No, no, no. เดี๋ยวยังไงติดต่อพี่แต่ว่าโทรมาก่อนนะพี่จะได้เคลียร์คิวให้โอเคเอาแบบนั้นก็ได้ค่ะขอบคุณพี่พี่มากเลยนะคะขอบคุณมากค่ะยินดีมากค่ะจับดูนะลูกตอนนี้ค่ะ sure oh my god เราจะมีคิวว่างให้ไหมอะแกตารางมันแน่นไปถึงปีหน้าเลยนะโอ้ยแกช่วยน้องเขาไปเถอะก็ได้ก็ได้เอาหน้าช่วยน้องเขาไป <laughs> These friends like <laughs> do crime together, you know. That's how you know you are really friends. I love them so much. Oh my god, the dynamic! Please. <laughs> แบบนี้แปลว่าเราก็มีเด็กในสังกัดเพื่อนแล้วจริงไปเพราะดูมีงานเยอะด้วยแต่ก็ไม่แน่หรอกแกฉันยังไม่เคยเจอผู้จัดการน้องเลยอ่ะไม่รู้ว่าดีหรือเปล่าฉันว่าน่าจะคุยได้นะอย่าพึ่งคำนวณค่ะลืมไปแล้วหรอว่าตัวเองต้องไปประกวดนางงามอ่ะไม่ได้บอกว่าจะประกวดนี่ฮะพี่นุ่นยานามาแล้วอยู่ดีมากค่ะอ๋อ this is so pretty สวัสดีค่ะสวัสดีค่ะที่หนูมาประกวดในวันนี้ oh my god เพราะหนูอยากจะหาค่ารักษาไปให้แม่ค่ะหนูอยากจะขอทำเพื่อแม่เป็นครั้งสุดท้ายก่อนที่แม่หนูจะโอเคโอเคพี่ว่าน้องออกไปพักก่อนดีกว่าเนาะโอ้ไม่เกินคนไปเชิญค่ะ Oh my God! So she's not even able to participate in the contest anymore. Like she's not. Like you know, it's so terrible because she's she was hoping for, you know, participate and and win. But like her mental state, unfortunately, it happens a lot. Like. But I know that in this kind of open contest, you should really not focus on explaining this dramatic stuff because it will mess with your energy on the day. It's going to be so hard to actually go through the the singing process or any art you are presenting. It's so hard. You have to navigate in between like your feelings and the reality of your situation, and at the same time, like the judges, they are not here to. Hear and empathize with your story. I hope, like Mina knows, that what she needs is her voice, because she has such a good voice, angelic voice. So, like, good luck. Ciao, Mina. Susu naka. Sawadika. Sawadika.
น้ำตัวเลยค่ะทีเนี่ยได้ยินค่ะหนูชื่อมีนาวิภาสุขค่ะมีนาบ้านรวยนะมีนา Excuse me like have you seen how she's dressed in a very humble manner like No, she must not be rich just because her name is like this. Uh, oh my God! What do you want to give to me? I think it's a dream. Oh, good, good. I want to hear the sound of my voice like the girl who told me to do it. But one thing is that I don't have money. หนูอยากมีเงินให้น้องได้เรียนต่อแล้วก็ได้ดูแลครอบครัวค่ะคุณไม่จะเอามากอยากร้องเพลงอยากให้คนอื่นได้ยินเหมือนที่น้องของมีนาได้ยิน That's a good approach you know <laughs> I'm so thankful for this series actually because like being able to have Infa singing through Mina's character like with all the problems that she had with the copyright issues and the older company that she want to be far away from like the production music production company like this is oh thank god for this series because she has such a beautiful voice like this is such a, a waste that she cannot sing because of a certain contract and contract like infringement oh, thank god she can right now like we can all experience this beautiful voice together สวัสดีค่ะเชลินคีนเองนะคีน the boyfriend ex boyfriend อย่าเขามาทำไม must be เขาเรามีเรื่องอยากให้เชลินช่วยอ่ะเชลินช่วยออกมาคีนหน่อยได้ไหม I feel sad for both of them ที่เดิมใช่ปะ Why would he need her though? Oh, oh, the cutest! Oh my god! <laughs> she is totally digging that very simple life, you know, just being next to plants and and like enjoying just a cup of noodles. So so cool. เอ้าเอ้ามีนาทําไมมาแอบกินมาม่าตรงนี้ล่ะลูกไม่ไปนั่งกินที่โต๊ะให้ดีๆ The way she's so amused แล้วหิวก็ทําไมไม่บอกป้าไปนั่งนะคะป้าจะได้ทำมาอะไรให้กินกินตัวหนูเกรงใจจริงๆค่ะพ่อชาติถ้ากินมาม่าเนี่ยหนูก็อิ่มแล้วค่ะพี่หลังอ่ะไม่ต้องเกรงใจนะถ้าหิวเนี่ยบอกป้าเลยนะเออแล้วทำไมวันนี้หนูถึงกลับเรียนนะลูกเขามีให้ร้องเพลงหลายรอบเหรอเปล่าล้วค่ะเนี่ยลงท่างอะค่ะก็เลยกลับเย็นโอ้โหทำไมไม่บอกป้าป้าจะ wait did she like did she said otoke otoke that's what I heard Thailand, as the rest of the world, is really crazy about gay drama, and I know that a lot of aunties are watching that at home because it's the same in Taiwan. <laughs> so, is it like a borrowed formula? 
If you are Thai and you understand what I'm saying right now, like, please help me in the comments because I'm really curious about this. Like, is it like a common borrowing nowadays? And it, especially because like the aunt lives in Bangkok. So I feel like she's more connected with the rest of the current trends. So like, is Otoke actually like a, a Korean borrowing? That would be so funny. Because I didn't know about this, because uh, what I like to watch is very traditional Thai drama, so it's like traditional Thai or even dialect Thai, so it's like, wow, <laughs> so cool. <laughs> Because they use it in the very same context. See, like, oh my god, okay, again, this is really, it really sounds like a, a borrowing with a like phonetic adaptation. Interesting, very interesting. Oh god, I love linguistics. Because in the same context, you oh, could actually me. say that in Korean. She really represents traditional Thailand throughout the drama, you know, because like in Thailand there are three pillars and one of them is obviously like religion. It plays out such a very, very important and deeply rooted uh, tradition in the culture that, you know, still they promote being a good Buddhist, you know, in, in Thailand. So like, this is so interesting. You did. <laughs> Can she like see what she's doing from this far? No, just the phone. Oh, loving the effects. Sharon in this episode is really going through it. Oh my god. <laughs> Sad from the start. This is completely her grieving process, like it means, I think, that the relationship between Keen and Shireen must have ended really, really not long ago. It's interesting because I think Mina seeing this is totally going to be more gentle with her when she sees her again. So I'm looking forward to this. <laughs> Mina the observer, I see you. I love you. <laughs> wow. 
such a good first episode. Oh my god. I have so many things to say, like... I obviously wanted a preview for the second episode. There is none. It's okay. But um, so far, so good. Like, I think this first episode was very interesting because we got to already have this whole bunch of um, first contexts and we see how from two situations completely unrelated to beauty pageant we will have a, a plot diving into the contest and the competition of the beauty pageant so it's actually interesting that it's not going from inward and spreading to uh, the rest of the characters you see like it's it's the opposite it's like the exterior consequences will result into having um, to go into the Miss Grand Thailand contest. So I like it. I think it's original. I like the dynamic between the characters. I wouldn't say enemy to lover trope. At least I can feel like the strangers to friends maybe to lover. It's very interesting. I like the fact that they had this moment through the cars with the beautiful cinematography. Irene was flustered by it and that's why she did not like she she was phasing out so you could say that already there was some kind of physical attraction or at least like energy attraction between them so i like that i could say that mina was also not indifferent but the difference she had such a bad experience afterward that she was just not vibing on the, they were just not on the same wavelengths you know so obviously for Mina she will need another clustering moment the sparks to happen again with Shireen I love Shireen's friends I love the dynamic with especially with Nudie they are really like comrades doing <laughs> crimes together and all it's so funny to watch I love the way they dress too but like again we are in uh, MGT series so like kudos to the closing department because they had to make it snap and they are snapping already so i love it i love the color grading of this whole first episode i hope that it stays um the same the use of the white uh very bright colors and colorful colors is really interesting because it it almost feels like a way to also pro promote island tourism in general. So I really like it. Uh, it was handled with such a care so far. The other characters, we all know their purpose, like the guest appearance, such as uh, Heidi, Makiki, and Anchat. So, like, it's good. The, the mom also, the mom we know, and we also know about Shirin's parents being abroad at the moment. So will we see them? I don't know, but I would hope so for her, for the MGT show. Because it's fast paced, I think that the second episode is going to... Uh, introduce Mina to the beauty pageant word like something is going to happen with the singing contest i think and get, and get familiar with the nightlife of uh, bangkok and i think that's where um shireen and her friends and and uh, ma kiki uh, they are going to to see her again and really have their eyes and their calculative mind on her but I think for Shireen, because it's going to be the second time that she feels something about Mina, I think uh, she would be genuinely intrigued by, uh, by her. So yeah, that's my guess for the second episode. <laughs> I think my favorite scene was the encounter between Charlotte and Mina, because you could see like the two different worlds they are living in. 
crushing so hard. Shireen has a car, Mina has, an, has nothing. She had to use public transportation and then motorbike f from someone like a, like a Uber motorbike. She is dressed so casually, yet Shireen is that this very classy working woman in Bangkok, you know, so everything is just so different. They are from really two different worlds. And the way they speak is also very different. Actually, I think Mina sounded very rude for like, someone like Shireen. At the same time, very traditional because she wanted like this apology. What's interesting is that Shireen's character was ready to apologize, which is such a strong shift already because her friends, when they had this phone conversation, they said that usually she doesn't back down. So even though she's at fault, she will not actually take the blame for it. It's interesting. That's how much she was bugged and intrigued by Mina's character. So something absolutely extraordinary happened. I was on the story of Charlotte Austin IG. Like, this is crazy. I was alongside other reactors. Like, I'm pretty sure she, she will never watch these reactions of mine. But, like, at least... Wow, I had my face on it. This is so crazy to me. Like, I can't even... Like, I don't have words. <laughs> Shout out to the account that actually made the whole uh, photo montage because it's really thanks to them that uh, I was able to be on the IG story of Charlotte. So thank you so much. This felt like a, a very cute accomplishment and I'm so thankful for it. So I want to say thank you for the whole community because this is all thanks to you. If you did not like um, comment and share it and uh, liked and subscribe to my channel, then nobody would see it and it would not reach a broader audience. So really, thank you so much. I love you so much. <laughs> I love you.